Hello, teachers. Let's take a look at the spelling word scavenger hunt activities. Please be aware that there are a bunch of different spelling word scavenger hunt templates to choose from, as you can see on the screen. For this demo video, I will be using the Thanksgiving template to show you how these activities work. Just so you know, when you're setting this up for students, the instructions for the students are pretty simple. All they need is a piece of paper. They need this piece of paper to write down their spelling words as they find them throughout the scavenger hunt. When the activity begins in a moment, the goal for your entire class as they work together is to make decisions to go around the scavenger hunt and find the digital envelopes that you see on the screen here. Once they find it, you click the envelope to open it and see the spelling word that they found. The adventure begins on the word page. Go in numerical order. So we'll start with word number one. So right away, students have to make a decision here. Do they go inside or do they look in the snow? If they decide to look in the snow, nothing is here. There's no envelopes, so we'll have to go back. And instead, we'll look inside. And there you go, an envelope on the table, click it, and it will reveal the first spelling word. Feel free to add in your own ideas. For example, if you want students to write sentences or write the definition of the word, feel free to do that too. When you are ready, move back to the word page and continue on and go to word number two. And once again, your class will have to make a decision about what they want to do. You can have your entire class vote together, or if you want, split them into groups and let them take turns choosing what decision is made. Students will have a fun time deciding what to do, and honestly, sometimes they'll have some tough decisions to make. Bring the digital scavenger hunts into your classroom today, and it will definitely add some excitement to your spelling lessons.